And we're back again. So yeah, we just... Take the letter. What do you want? Oh, um, we, we've got a letter. We need one gold for the postage. Oh, well, why didn't you just say so? Come on in. Wait there while I get the money. And don't you touch anything. The mother, because she'll pay us if we just wait here. But then, if we give it to Belinda upstairs, maybe they can run away together. It's somewhere. That must be Belinda. I don't know. But this is wonderful. Here's something for your trouble. Oh, Monty. Babies. My little dove. I guess some people's wishes do come true. We did it. We can buy the music box now. Get back in the house. Can't wait to see what it can do. What? Oops. Oh, Monty, I love you. No, you don't. He's poor. Oh, mother, you're such a shrew. That's why father left you. You can't get another man. Belinda, you shouldn't talk to your mum like that. Oh, now you're taking her side. What? No. Well, maybe you should marry her instead. But you're my one true love. Without you, there are no stars and no moon in my night sky. Only the cold, crushing dark of your absence. Um... Hello. Very wise little ones. Go ahead and turn the handle, but mind you go somewhere quiet. Let's go make our wish, little sparrow. Oh, I don't know if I mentioned before, but the gold trail is just telling you where your current active quest is at. sure this was it. I had this feeling like, like we weren't going to be stuck in Old Town anymore. Why didn't the box take us with it? Move. What are you doing here? I'm sure I didn't wish for you. All right, fine. Welcome to our little paradise. Come on, Sparrow, go to bed. Settle down. There's a nice, uh, angry, stray dog. Quiet, boy. What do you want? Higher work for Lord Lucian, Miss 
and he would very much like to see you in his castle. I've been sent to collect you. came true. Come on, little sparrow, wake up. It's all right, Dobby. We're going to Lord Lucian's castle. I'll come back for you. I promise. Yep. Evening, James. Here are the children Lord Lucian asked for. Excellent. Hello, young lady. Hello, sir. If you'll follow me, please. We look up at this castle every day and think how nice it is. We both do. But inside, it's even more beautiful than I imagined. It is quite it's really wonderful. annoying sometimes when you have to walk. Ah, hello, Master Garth. <laughs> Man of few words. Where is the Grand Dining Hall? Oh, in the North Wing. Lord Lucian hasn't been in there since... since the tragic deaths of Lady Fairfax and Little Amelia. Oh, I heard. That was so awful. Yes, but we're here to replace him. So, where does he eat? Actually, he takes most of his meals in his study. He's in there working all hours doing research. What does he research? On well, history, mostly. Lord Lucian is quite keen on antiquities of all sorts, but he's chiefly interested in things relating to the old kingdom. There was a trader in Old Town who said his stuff was from the old kingdom. Yes, yes. I believe Lord Lucian heard about that. We bought a piece of it, and we made a wish, and now we're here. Well, that's wonderful. Now, when you meet Lord Lucian, you must show respect at all times. Address him as my lord. Speak only when spoken to. Yes, sir. And do not mention Lady Fairfax or Amelia. Here we are. I'm gonna move this on to the next video because I don't wanna.